The Speaker of the House of, of Assembly, Right Honorable Emmanuel Emerowa, permit me to use you to reach other members of the House of Assembly here, both seven and former. Distinguished Senator Arlington. My brother, who, like we all know, we voted for. I'm happy that he's always here with us and he was not shaken by what happened. Like I've always told him. For God to allow something to happen, it must be for a purpose. He's still very young. We'll put him back in 2027. <laughs> 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 The outspoken House of Reps member representing a good people of East Elangwa North and South Federal Constituency. And I would like to use you to reach other House of Reps members there, both serving and former. Honorable Commissioner, for local government and chieftaincy affairs, Prince Ozo Mwachuku, let me use you to reach all the commissioners that are here with us today. Let me use the chief of staff to the governor, Pastor Pele Adiaba to reach other government appointees that are here, special advisors, senior special assistants, special assistants, heads of agencies, parastatals, permanent secretaries. I'd like to welcome all of you. The mayor of mayors, the chairman, of the Mayor's Council in Abia State and the Mayor of Isialangwa South Local Government Area, Dr. Elelenta Wambuisi Elele. Let me use uh, Mayor Elele. And of course, the beautiful wife to now reach other mayors that are here. I've seen Ude, Ude John Udabala, mayor of Abanov. 
and a lot of other mayors. I use Mayor Lele to reach all of you. I also use him to reach deputy mayors and councillors that are here with us. And I would like to thank you for putting this event together, together with all the members of the organizing committee and all our brothers and sisters that are here. I cannot thank you enough. Your Royal Majesty, Eze, Nelson, Merengwa, let me reach, use you to reach all the traditional rulers that are here with us. We are also privileged to have the chairman of the Council of Traditional Rulers with us here. Is the Linus Mutumba. Maybe you, the two of you, to reach other revered traditional rulers that are here with us and thank you for joining us. Your Grace, the Archbishop of Aba Province of the Anglican Dominion, Right Reverend Dr. Isaac Chijoki. Let me welcome you and your beautiful wife, Mommy Mwabia. And let me also use you to reach other anointed men and women of God that are here with us. The leadership of Labour Party in Abia State. Let me use the Secretary of Labour Party in the state to reach all the members of leadership that are here. My brothers and sisters, Ndomoba, Ndemvose, Ndisi Alangwa South, Ndisi Alangwa North, Ndosi Sioma, Unabiala E. Oh no, no, too late. Hundred percent. Go your I want to. I want to thank you. My speech will be brief. Let me start by thanking all of you that found out to celebrate us today. To tell you the truth, it was a very difficult decision for me to accept. Not that I didn't want to be celebrated as such. But the truth is that it's still early days. And um, somehow, I tried to run away from events like this. Because if you don't caution yourself, particularly when you are a leader, it is possible to derail. It is possible for you to begin to seek and clog the media. It is possible for people to start celebrating what does not exist. We are from this state. And we know that crowds like this, we are not unavailable in the previous years when this state was became. We also knew that people have a way of celebrating leadership just because somebody is occupying a leadership position and not because of what the person has done. So it was very difficult for me to accept. But having accepted this, I will say that you have represented every other local government in Abia State. Of course, I did accept the one that was hosted in December 
by the right honorable speaker because it was the speaker. And even when I was going there, I went quietly. Ah, so having now done this, I think we have done enough. Do you agree? Yes, sir. So we will now go back and settle down and start the work. Yes. If you watch me carefully and if you listen to me, I said we will settle down and do work. Start the work. What does that mean? We have not started. So what you have seen in the last eight months is what the Englishman will call dress rehearsal. In the last eight months, we, we are running from one federal high court in Kano to the Court of Appeal in Kano to the Supreme Court on the Kano matter then the tribunal in Omoaya, Court of Appeal in the Uwere sitting in Lagos, and then Supreme Court again, the second time. Well, we refuse to allow all those distractors because we know, just like Dr. Elene had put it, Jeremiah, that no matter how much they fight you, they will not prevail against you once you have the Lord with you. So we did not fear. We concentrated on the work. But now our concentration will be more than doubled because I don't know that there is any other court matter. <laughs> So even if there are people who are contemplating court matters, please tell them that I have immunity. <laughs> so I want to say a big thank you to the organizers of this event. It is uh, unfortunate that uh, the way I would have loved to celebrate, I couldn't anymore because I'm bereaved. And if you don't mind, I would like us to stand up and observe a minute silence for a friend of this state, a friend of most of us in the governance of this state, who we lost together with his wife and his first child, Mr. Herbert Wewe, the former CEO of Access Corporation. One minute silence, please. May the soul of Dr. Herbert Wewe, Mrs. Chizoba Wewe, and Mr. Chizi Wewe, and the souls of other faithfully departed rest in the bosom of the Lord. Amen. Amen. Shall we be seated? Just like it's been reported, a lot of things are happening around us. We decided that at any touch point in the state, anytime you get into the state from somewhere, you will know you have entered at your state. And that is why we have started the dualization of the Owerenta Omoeka. Road.
Without, we should not stop it at Omeka. So, we now also extended it, that dualization from Omeka all the way to Omoenye. And from Omoenye, we will bring it into Omoaba. We also went to Onwimo and we also dualized it, moving it to join the tower. The tower to Opera Sphere has already uh, been receiving serious attention. In the next two days, precisely on Monday, the 20th of this month, they are going to be advertising in the dailies the construction of the Itungwa, Mboko, Amiri, Amise, Ahyadwobi, Mpo Eleji, and Omo Barut. This 19.1 kilometer road is being done in conjunction with the World Bank. So the advertisement will be in the papers on Monday. The bidding process will be open for one month and latest by April, the construction will start. The whole idea is to open up our places so that people can have access. Most of us are farmers here. Yeah? We will not forget you. We have a robust program to support agriculture. As we speak, two partners, one from the Hungarian government and the other CSS farms in Abuja, they are in the state trying to study our uh, topography and see how they can support us so that we will begin to feed this nation, not just at their state. Distinguished ladies and gentlemen, let me once again thank the organizers of this event. Let me thank you for the great job that you have done. Let me welcome the new entrants into our party. We are happy to receive everyone and our doors are open. So if there are those who are still contemplating which way to go, I have directed that our registers should now be open and everybody that wants to come should be welcome. So I know that uh, the MC was cracking jokes and uh, I'm happy that our new joiners understood that it was a joke. We are Labour Party and we are open to receive everybody. So do not have any doubt, any issues with returning, even if you left before. If you want to come back, you are welcome to come back. Maybe finally, reassure us that my definition of leadership is stewardship. So anytime you depart from stewardship and you want to be the ogre, then you have lost it. 
And I would like everybody to also join me in that mantra so that we can serve our people well. Distinguished ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for listening. As you go back, God will bless you and keep you. Bless your families. And at the end of the day, what is important is that when we have finished the race, I will all make heaven. That's my prayer for you in mm -hmm. Jesus' name. Thank you very much.